Welcome, in this video I'm going to go over adding Lutron Caseta to my Home Assistant instance. So I'll put a link below to the Lutron hardware I'm using. And if you find this video helpful, I'll put a link to it in the description on Amazon. And if you use that link, it helps me out a little bit and doesn't cost you anything extra. So I have a Lutron Smart Hub with Ethernet on it. They also make a wireless version. So to add it, I'll go to Settings. If you don't see Settings here on the left, scroll down. If you have multiple dashboards, it might get hidden. Then I'll go to Devices and Services. So now I'll hit Add Integration. Now I already have it up here, so I could just hit Configure. But if you're not seeing it here, you can go to Add Integration. And I'm going to make a note of this IP address because I'll need it. So here I'll search for Lutron. I'll click on Lutron Caseta. I'll type in that IP address. Now if it wasn't discovered and you don't know the IP address, you can go into your router and look for DHCP leases and look for Lutron there and see if you can find the IP address that way. You can also use other scanning tools to maybe find it. So I'll hit submit. Now it says to pair. I need to press submit on this form and then press the black button on the back of the bridge. So I'll do that. I'll hit submit and then I'll go press that button. So I'll press this button. It says it found the following devices. We found the Smart Bridge 2, and we found the Front Foyer Garage Sconce Light Switch. I'll hit Finish. Now we'll go to Overview. Now I can click on this here. It will turn the light on, but I can also click on this and bring up the control. And this is a dimmer, so I can turn it up to whatever level I want. So if we look at the bottom of the screen here, it's during the day, but you can see this tiny little triangle of light. I'll click the button to turn it off. That will go off and then I'll turn it on, and now it's on all the way. You can see it just flashed on, and I can turn it to 50%, and I can turn it off again. I also have a scene set up on the Lutron Smart Hub, and that brought that in here, the guest arriving scene, so I can hit that. I think that turns the lights down 100%. So that's how you hook up the Lutron Caseta Smart Hub to Home Assistant. That's all I'm going to cover in this video. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments. If you like this video, please kick like. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I'd appreciate if you could do that. And thanks for watching. Until next time, goodbye.